Hi everyone, Rainy Bast Rash here. Have you ever had a hard time making a decision? Maybe teetering between should I do it, shouldn't I do it, should I go here, shouldn't I? Well, here's a technique that I use with clients and for myself quite often that works really well. Matter of fact, it works with your subconscious mind because as you know, your subconscious is connected to the universal consciousness, so it has all the answers. We just don't know how to access it or listen to it. So rather than making a conscious decision, a limited decision, here's a way to make a subconscious division. So I want you to think of something. We're going to do it right now. I'm going to do it with you. I want you to think of something right now that you've been trying to make a decision on. Something that could have a yes or no answer. That's very important. Like, should I go to Disney on vacation this year with my family? Yes or no. Do I really need to buy that new car? Okay, it's a yes or no question. Or, should I purchase that new hypnosis certification course with the American School of Hypnosis? That's a yes or yes question. Oops, yes or no question. <laughs> okay. So it's important that it's a yes or no answer, and you need to make a decision right now that whatever the answer is that you find as a result of this, I guess you could say demonstration, that you commit to following it. That's a really important part of this. You need to commit to following the outcome. That's vital. So here's how we do it. We have a very intricate piece of equipment we use. It's called a coin okay you can do it with a quarter for some reason I couldn't find a quarter in a house in today's day and age of credit cards and online banking to find a coin is hard so I went into a bank and I actually found a British coin okay you notice how it's, it's not even round <laughs> but anyway it's kind of a cool coin so I'm going to use this one here's the way it works I want you to think of the question that you have right now because this will work for as many people that are doing it all at once Think of the question that you have, and I'm going to flip this coin, and if it comes down and lands on heads, the answer is yes to your question. If it lands on tails, your answer is no. Very important. So you ready? Think of the question. Here we go. Whoa. The answer is heads. The answer is yes. See, just so you know I didn't cheat, there it is right there. The answer is yes. So think of your question. Your answer is yes. And very important now, this is the second part of the decision-making process. How do you feel about it? How do you feel about the yes answer? Do you feel good about it? For those of you that feel good about your answer, that's it. Go on and do it. Your subconscious mind gave you the answer. But how about for those of you that feel bad? If you feel negative about your answer, if there's a stupor of thought, you just don't feel good about it, then guess what? Turn the coin over to tails, your answer is no. How do you feel about that? If you feel good about the no answer, then that's your answer. Wow, wait a minute, I swapped the coin over. The coin doesn't matter. The coin is just a tool to get you to make a decision. You see, the subconscious works according to feelings. As you know, the subconscious mind, in the subconscious, there is no such thing as negative. That's a conscious thing. The subconscious and even the universal consciousness only is inclusive, only is positive. So if you have a positive feeling, that's a subconscious answer. If you have a negative feeling, negative is not of the subconscious, that's of the conscious mind. So if you have a negative feeling, flip the coin over because it doesn't matter because the coin is just chance. It's how you feel. So the main thing to keep in mind is that your decision-making mechanism is your emotions, your feelings. How do you feel about it? If you feel good with the answer, the answer is yes. If you feel bad, do the opposite, flip it over the other side, and that's your answer. You need to feel good. Like I said, the coin is irrelevant. It's just a tool to make you make a decision. Now, you had never done this before, so I told you whatever the decision is, you need to follow through with it. So this way, you're not changing your mind. But once you saw that you felt bad and you could change it, wasn't that so much better? Kind of like if I told you, you know, should you buy this hypnosis certification course and it said no, oh, you'd be so depressed. Flip it over, yes, you should buy it. 
oh, I feel great. Then you go out and make that decision. So I'll expect a lot of sales here shortly. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed it. Try it with your friends. Share this with your friends and see how they do. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe below and have a great day. Bye-bye.